Oh. Maybe, should he look at the camera or should he look like... He can look at the camera because the other shots he was looking at us. So, what about the race car thing? You need the hobby. What do you do for fun? What are your hobbies oh, back home? Well, uh, on the weekend, me and my friends, we uh, I have a motorbike, so we go in the night, like 11, 12 o'clock in the night. On the motorbike, we go for, we go in the desert until the morning, just like hanging out in the desert. Do you have a bike here? No. Do you miss your bike? Motorbike? Mm-hmm. Uh, not really, but because, you know, sometimes, I don't know how to say it, but my motorbike compared now to the others, it's still like, it's very old. Yeah. So, and now I have changed completely when I came here to USA, so I don't, I think more about studying. Yeah. How have you changed? Well, how are all the ways you've changed being here since you've been at home? First, I start. I started to be independent. When I was back home, everything just asked my dad. When I before decide to do something, I just asked my parents or my friends. But when I when I came here, you just have to be independent and you make your choices and decisions. All by yourself. So what, um, when you were like back at home compared to here, like what, what do you miss from back at home? Well, of course I miss my family, my parents, and uh, I miss my friends and, and they, when we go outside with them. And yeah, I miss also my little sisters. How did your um? How was your like school life? Like, did you always know you were gonna come to college? We were back home. Mm -hmm. Like, did you always know that you were gonna go to college? Yeah, 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 definitely. Uh, when I was seventeen, I got a scholarship to study in uh, Canada. So I went to Canada when I was seventeen, just for summer program. Then, so this scholarship, they said, you, after graduating from high school, you want to go to study abroad in the USA. So I have my, so I know that I'm, I'm coming to USA. So. Did you get to pick the school? Uh, no. They picked it for you? Yeah, they picked uh, six universities, and uh, I got acceptance from three of these. Which ones did you get accepted from? I got accepted from uh, Iowa State University and uh, School of Mines. It's uh, in Colorado and from Michigan State. Where else did you apply? Hmm? Where else were the... Yeah, I applied for uh, Tucson, University of Arizona, and uh, University of California, Irvine, and uh, University of uh, Purdue. Purdue. I know some So how was um how's the weather very there? Like do you like the cold snow? <laughs> well in the first week of the snow when when it starts snowing here, <laughs> it was exciting for me because uh, it was my first time to see snow. So I like the weather the first week. So after that I said no more, I don't want snow anymore. And the weather back home because it's hot and uh, even if you have winter, the winter is still about 50 degrees or 60 degrees. So where do you, um, did you have to go like shopping for a whole new wardrobe when you came here? What did you wear back at home? Yeah, back home we wore like traditional clothes. It's completely different from what you guys wear. And, uh, Why don't you wear it here? I don't know, I feel like everybody is going to look at me, so it's a little bit weird. So when you got here, did you kind of like look at the type of things that other 
people your age were wearing and stuff? No. When I came here, I used my... I went with my dad back home to shopping, so all my clothes was like for old people. <laughs> so I came here, so I saw my friends who are from UAE, from the UAE. So I start change my style. Do your friends still wear that stuff? <laughs> Which stuff? Uh, the like traditional clothes. Yeah. No, no. I mean, no, nobody wears. I mean, they wear like. More fashionable things and maybe simple. Have you ever been to like an American wedding? Not yet. What's a typical age for you to get married? Back home. Back home. Uh, it's normal to get married when you are 20, 21. What um, about having kids? Yeah, 20, 21. And it's weird when you get married when you are 29 or 30. People think like something wrong with this guy. Or... And it's kind of like that here too, though. <laughs> yeah, if you're really old when you're married, but then it's kind of typical for people not to get married. So back home, is it like, um, do people usually get married before they have kids, or does it matter? No, I mean, your wife. If I want to have a wife back home. You just see the wife. You don't go with her by yourself, like you and her. So, it, like, if I said now I want to get married, and I said I want to know this girl, I haven't seen her before, but my family go talk with her family. So then I can just see the wife, the woman, I mean, and I can talk with her. But her parents, like one of his parents or his brothers, with her, like staying with her, so just talking. So, do you have to wait to have sex? <laughs> <Sorry>. <laughs> I mean, I know like over here, kids have sex all the time, <laughs> really young. And back home, is it like, for the guy? well I know for the girls it's probably different, but for the guys, do you have to wait? It uh, depends. Are you supposed to wait on like the wife <clears throat> till you? Are you supposed to wait till you get married to have sex? Uh, depends. I told you some people, some people not. Like, is it looked down upon if you have sex before you're married? Mm -hmm. I don't know. Can you change the topic? I just want to talk about. <laughs> We're like that girl. <laughs> <laughs> is it so what fun? about like? What about yeah? What about like drinking and um? It's still on. <laughs> what about like drinking and like smoking and partying and stuff like that? Things that we do here at college, like back home, do they look down on stuff like that? Uh, partying is different from here. Back home, it's like party. It's almost the party. Your friends and your friends are men. All of them are men, boys. So. This is the party, and we don't drink. Our party is by talking or playing a little bit, or going out to the downtown, or going sitting in the desert at the night and talking until the morning. Or... So everyone basically hangs out with their own gender. Like all the guys hang out with guys, and all the girls hang out with girls. Yeah. So what about um? Would you ever? Would you ever date or marry an American woman, even though she's not like your family at home? Mm. It's difficult to answer this question because I don't know how to say that. Do you think your family would approve? They might not at the beginning, but later they, they will, but uh, it's still like weird. You know? I get it. Do so you have like an understanding family here? Like, like do, are they understanding like then are they really strict on you like telling uh, what you can and can't do or no no they, they don't they said you know what to do um, they trust you yeah they, they said you know what's your future it's, you just do whatever you want 
what um how do you like how is it different how your parents raise the guys as they do raise the females mm, there isn't that different but as i told you uh the men go the boys they go with their father father like when they go outside and they stay with other old men and old people and the woman just stay with the woman. So back at home, it's um, like the females, they have to stay covered all the time? After when, when, the, when the female like get maybe 18 or 16, this age, she start like covering like, her body. So when she's younger, she can. Hmm? She, so when she's younger, she can actually show. Yeah, because like it depends on the family. Sometimes some family they don't care. Like oh. uh, if you want to put the, the scarf, just for a few. If she doesn't want. Is the is it like supposed to be like is the hair spo- is their hair supposed to be like sacred or something like they're supposed to keep it covered? Mm-hmm. I've heard that before. Okay. Should we have them say it? What, um, say something in Arabic. Hold on. Hold on. Say. Should we have them say it in here? Or say yeah, it in just front? say it. Just say it. We could what? go in front of, um, excuse me, the, um, like, Michigan State University sign. Oh, the 